We're also working breaking news tonight. Police uncover a ma major mortgage fraud scheme right here in Rhode Island. And now a North Providence man is charged with bilking dozens of people out of more than $10 million. And investigators say he didn't act alone. Eyewitness News reporter Sean Daly is live at State Police Headquarters in Situate, where a news conference just wrapped up. He joins us now with the breaking details. Yes, Aaron, the state police say a 75-year-old North Providence man cooked up an elaborate and illegal mortgage fraud scheme through which dozens of people lost more than $10 million. Top state police troopers faced news cameras less than an hour ago and revealed the results of a two-year investigation into what they say is massive real estate fraud. A statewide grand jury today indicted the owner of this modest home in North Providence, 75-year-old Peter Shabbat Jr., on 34 counts of obtaining money under false pretenses. The indictment alleges that Peter Shabbat engaged in a complicated series of mortgage fraud schemes that victimized dozens of investors as well as renters who thought they'd be able to buy the properties they either had invested in or were renting. The victims lost more than $10 million. Mr. Shabbat was obviously more concerned with uh, stealing every dime he could under any means possible uh, at a time when, frankly, our economy was in collapse uh, because of the subprime lending market and culprits like this. Uh, Mr. Shabbat, for me, stands as the poster child across America uh, for doing something that he has done to innocent renters and investors. Prosecutors say Peter Shabbat didn't act alone. Three other people also are accused in this scheme, although to a much lesser degree. Live at State Police Headquarters with the Northwest Mobile Newsroom, Sean Daly, Eyewitness News.